Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Nene. Nene Leaks is who we're going to be talking about today on the channel. Deb Chanel's 48th World... Yes, she is getting down with the butt lift. Yes, she is. She's getting down with the butt lift. She's taking stuff out and repositioning it in her buttocks area. Okay. I'm like, Nene girl. Nene girl. Did your man, Naomi, was feeling on your assets on your behind and he felt like they were just flat girl and you got offended probably got your feelings hurt and he probably said you need to uh and that's a white woman y'all that's a black woman trying to be a white woman and saluting the elite with that uh, crazy looking hair okay now that picture to the left uh, that's a doable thing that's a doable thing okay very it's very flattering on her when she come with this straight old blonde platinum wig, I'm like, girl, we know who team you with. We know you on the elite's team, okay? I try to be. But, honey, either way, they shading the hell out you. They are shading the hell out you. What was supposed to have been positive in your eyes was pure jokester move. It was a jokester move. And people are clowning you on the internet, honey. Because I got my story from... Uh, Black Enterprise, but page six is uh, pretty much dogging you. Entertainment Tonight, E.T., who one of the very biggest uh, new celebrity uh, feed you can be on, honey. They clowning you. Girl, boss is clowning you. Uh, News Time is clowning you. Princeton Daily Carson, Carrion is clowning you. Mm-hmm. Yes, 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 and it's probably some more clowning you too, but I just thought I would bring out those, and I am getting my commentary from Black Enterprise, because that was too funny. They tied up their article on you, Nene, not booked, but busy getting a butt lift. <laughs> the shade, honey, the shade. Woo, I'm like, you got to stop listening to these men, honey, when they telling you that your butt flat back there. Now, I'm just uh putting my own two cents in. I don't know that to be true. Okay, it's all alleg allegedly over here. All right, we just having a conversation with the fam. Fam, we have conversations, do we not? Yes, we do. I say what I'm going to say. I give you the news that I got it from or the re or resources I got it from, references. And then I ask you to weigh in on the subject topic. Yes, I do. Because, you know, we are booked and busy telling people's stories. Wonder why? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. And I would have been on... Uh, what do you call it? I would have been on my platform showing my face doing this introduction of a story that Nene put out here on herself. Okay. It's called self-sabotage. All right. But if you haven't watched my other video that I did on her, meaning the court had dismissed her case and she's going to have to do what she should have done in the first place is go through arbitration, which is that's what her contract depicts her to do. But anyway, I just wanted to show these pictures because you know I am a big image person. And when I look at the images, I develop my story on that way. Okay? It just comes to life. But I had to show the images because I'm like, nay, nay. 
Oh, you just do things like other people do things. Because, again, like I said, we're going to reference Candy and her uh, reduction of her breasts and how she wanted us to see all of that so she could be transparent. Because, you know, people do get it uh, bad when they're trying to use plastic surgery to enhance their looks, you know. And we always speculate. We always uh, regulate. And we want to have an opinion on our so-called local celebrities and what they're doing to their bodies to fit in a mold of plastic people okay anytime you're with hollywood or trying to be with hollywood on that serious side you kind of lose yourself to them okay it's like you're selling yourself to them and they're saying okay we're gonna make you over and you agree with that but as time goes on you get weary you get tired you don't want to do it anymore but see you sign that contract with the entertainment department and you know how that goes okay gotta be a lot of sacrifices gotta be a lot of doing things you don't want to do and I hear that, you know, most people eat shit. And I'm talking about the feces that come out of your body. All right. That's what we call the illuminated ones. They do a lot of shit for the get that fame and fortune. But I don't know how deep Nene is in the situation. But it just is what it is. And I did. I can't remember that child last name. But her name was Taylor. Uh, her her dad did Nene's teeth. Uh, and once I get her last name, if I can remember, I'm not good at remembering the full names as I'm getting older. But maybe I got some old paperwork or notes we used to write each other uh, when we were um, dealing with patients and stuff. Or when she gave me birthday cards and I gave her birthday cards. But I know she should have gotten married by now. I've lost touch with her and that's a shame but um that's what happens when you're not working for that same organization and you don't really float in the same circle friendship circles business circles but um yeah anyway i remember baby girl first name <sighs> but um yeah nini's around here getting butt lifts at her age and, you know, like I said, surgery is definitely a 50-50 chance. You can come in, out of it or you can just die in the process of doing so. And it kind of, when she was trying to say she's going to do all that, uh, kind of made me think about Kanye West's mom, Donda. She did the same type of thing. I don't know if it was here in the States that she was getting two procedures done at the, at the same time. I don't know if she was trying to do her breasts and her stomach but I think she was. She was trying to do a, a total makeover at the same time, which I wouldn't advise nobody to, you know, get cut on in several places and try to heal. Because, ooh, can you think about the pain afterwards? Woo, you probably have to take a whole year off to just get through that pain that's going to probably be with you those first three to six months. You see what I'm saying? Woo, but anyway, going to the article, uh, Yolanda uh, Burrich, uh, Burrook had did the article for a black enterprise on our lovely lovely nene leak so okay she titled it not book but busy getting a bbl watch form a real housewives of atlanta star nene leaks undergo a brazilian butt lift and you know see that's what uh these celebrity reality uh people get their big heads when we put that star on there so you know they like lights camera ash oh wait a minute lights camera action lights 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 y'all remember that song but anyway going to the article it says these days nini leaks is taking some me time giving her claims that she's been blacklisted in the entertainment industry and can't secure a job a situation she blamed on her former Real Housewives of Atlanta boss Andy Cohen is what they call him. Okay. Uh, at issue, the two have butted heads over Leek's claims that she experienced racism on the set of the hit Bravo show when Cohen vehemently denies which he he vehemently denies okay emphatically denies he just denied 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 and of course he's learned that and mastered that 
type of skill to the T. I want to hip you to the T. Yeah, that's Tina Marie. Okay, but going at back at the article, it said on the flip side, now Lisa is putting heads together to discuss her buttocks. Yes, we're talking about her ass. Okay, we're talking about her ass, y'all. Although the 54 year old Atlanta based restaurateur has been a little less booked and busy these days, she took to her Instagram to chronicle her journey of getting a Brazilian 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 butt lift, commonly called a BBL. Although Leeks has been candid about her previous plastic surgeries, including a nose job, BBLs are considered a little more concerning. The dangerous procedure transfers fat from one section of your body, most likely the abs, to a person's buttocks to make them more rounded and bouncier. Bounce, mm-mm-mm-mm, rock, skate, mm-mm-mm-mm. Roll, bounce. Hey, I took y'all back. Rock, skate, skate. Yes, honey. If you were roller skating during those days or the 70s, 80s, you were doing your thing. All right. But I just got, when they said uh, bounce, rounded and bounce, I just remembered that song and I thought I would serenade you all again. All right. Throughout my commentary. But we go back to the article. It says, Leaks announced that she signed up as an ambassador for Dr. Stanley Okoro's Georgia Plastic Surgery and Reconstructive Surgery Center and implored her fans to join her on the Perfectly Pretty You journey, according to ET Online. Now, how Nene was looking at that man, looked like she wanted to lop him up like a, sl- a slab of grits. Wanted slab of grits with the butter in it, melting, and a biscuit sitting to the side. She wanted to eat that man up, y'all. I'm like, Shabba Man, you better watch her girlfriend. Because she's getting her digs, her eyes on someone else. I couldn't tell if he was wearing a wedding band, but she was all over that little man. You know what I'm saying? Because Nene towers over people because she's a. Uh, a tall person I think she should wear flats more so so she could be equaled out to because she's too tall she towered over Greg she's towered towered over Naomi and this little fella uh, of African descent she towers over him as well okay now you see that complexion on their knees boy she giving me Michael Jackson tees Michael Jackson tees and his told tale of having Virago, okay yes but no he didn't he just wanted to brighten himself up but you would have people disagree with that analogy okay but now we go back to nini's words i did it i got a with dr okuro following my surgery journey with dr okuro at georgia plastic i'm almost ready to show off my new snatched look but i want you to be snatched too Leaks posted, I partnered with Georgia Plastic to give all of you guys uh, the dollar. Just use my code or discount off and let them know I sent you. Okay, while we couldn't seem to share the Instagram post, click here to check out the actual video and peep some new pics on Nene. Yes, 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 yes. The Real Housewives star admitted when she first heard of BBL, she thought her doctor intended to give her a massive posterior. However, she's she and Dr. Okuro coined her new look as a professional mini BBL. A showbiz reported. Now, Nene, stop your shit, okay? You just up your ante, put some fat around that buttock so Naomi, Naomi could feel a little bit more. Because he was saying it's flat, flat as a pancake. And it probably hurt Nene's feelings. So she just rushed to the surgeon to do those type of things. And it just is what it is. But that's something you're going to have to live with, Nene. Uh huh. You're going to have to live with that uh, fat being situated over there in your buttocks area. It might cause some issues, but hey, you wanted it, so we don't want to hear you blame about it. And uh, Dr. Okuro, you might be, you know, <laughs> hey, you might need to be securing yourself. But I'm sure you got lawsuit uh, insurance, uh, malpractice insurance. I'm sure you got that on lock because you best be to trust your ambassador she will get you if something comes up with the back of her buttocks down the road just you know caution to the doctor caution to the doctor all right 
now we go back to the article. It says Leek said she liked her backside but wanted to improve some areas. I only I'm only looking to fixing my problem areas. She called them dents, y'all. But it just is what it's like. She was showcasing a car or something. But anyway, so we called in a professional mini BBL. And I love it, Leeks explains. Okay. She was interested in the liposuction 360 and wanted to address her bra, roll, and stomach, according to Monsters and Critics. In one clip she posted on Instagram, leaks can be seen in the operating room undergoing the procedure while she has not unveiled her new look. Leaks offered her fans an exclusive promotion for those inter interested in having work done by Okuro. Okay, Okuro. Alrighty, so yeah, this is what um she called herself doing. Mm-hmm. Trying to be snatched from head to toe yes that's what she called herself doing mm -hmm. but y'all what do y'all think about nene going around here spending all her money getting plastic surgery done and don't have a pot to piss in and a wing window to sling it out of because yes if y'all hadn't watched my other video she has definitely uh she i guess she just don't care who who knows okay because she didn't possibly go to her hearing where the judge threw out her case um <laughs> i want to say frivolous case of trying to sue on something she knew she had to go through arbitration but she wanted to go through those necessary steps we don't know why or how or who told her to do it because to me it looked like it was dumbass mood he should have been negotiating from the get-go but that's just my thinking. That's just my opinion. <coughs> just like people have assholes, I have opinions, okay? But, uh, yeah. So, y'all get down in the comments. Y'all tell me what y'all thought about Miss Nene Legs. Going around here talking about she all natural. She's all natural. Like, no, Nene, you're not all natural. Because, uh, yeah, baby girl, uh, you got veneers on your teeth. Then you got, uh... Your butt lift, okay? You're lightening up your skin, okay? And you wear fake hair. I'm like, is there a time to when you'll stop wearing fake hair, baby girl? I'm not really sure if you even care about getting back to your urban roots. <laughs> no pun intended. But yes, yeah, she loves that fake hair. Yep, if they stop making fake hair, I wonder what Nene would look like. Because to me, she would look like a, a a pretty Angela Davis. You know what I'm saying? A Foxy Brown. She wore a fro. But Nene's just not in that area. She just wants to be that white woman, okay? And it's coming out in her attitude. Because she's definitely Lee, been acting like a Karen. Okay, yes, she has. And now she has the buttocks. She has the hair. She has the nose job. She has the teeth job. So, yes, I don't know. Maybe she's going to do her toes next. Who knows, honey? Who knows with Nene? Because she's not booked. So, she's busy doing other things. Other things, people. But that's all I got for this particular video. I just had to come with the graphics, the vision of my commentary. I had to get y'all images because this is just total shambles total shambles Nene has gotten herself into and it seems like this is what she wants to do if her so-called man wants her to look younger uh yeah allegedly you know he's the little fruity so I wouldn't even be trying to do anything because it seems like he's gonna be going to the fruit tree more than he's gonna be playing in your paradise yard Nene I'm just saying I could be totally wrong but that's what's giving me especially with them little flip flaps and then you joining him in them little furry slippers and shit I know I know my family has told me look I hear girl men can pamper themselves too that don't necessarily make them fruity you are absolutely right but I'm nosy as hell. And that's a, that's the twin. This is my gut feeling that's telling me that he's a little fruity. Okay, that's all. That's all. I'll let y'all have y'all opinion. I'll let me have mine. Okay, thank you. All right, but that's all I got for this particular video, girl, uh, girls and guys. I don't have any more. And I will see y'all on the next video. And happy Sunday. Bye-bye.